This is my 1998 Yamaha GP1200. Um, it's my setup to work on it. It's hot as hell out. Um, so I just wanted to do a video so you can see how I took this out. I didn't see any instructional videos on how to do this with the motor in. Um, so it's really not that bad. Um, I bought this on eBay. It's an SVT Universal flywheel puller. Um, I did have to buy, it comes with um, a center, which actually fell in here, um, but it's like a big, So it's a, it's a, this one goes in the middle and pushes on the, on the crankshaft of the jet ski right here, uh, right there. So this pushes in through here um, and separates the flywheel. Um, I did have to buy longer screws. The ones that came with were, were definitely too short. I don't know why they even include that. Um, it has to go here and then go all the way into these holes that are down there. So it's uh, so I got longer screws, probably about two and a half times the length of these. Um, so you screw them in to the front. Uh, it's a lot of patience. It took me a really long time to get the screws in. I suggest maybe using um, just like a stud type and then use a nut on the one end so you can just put it in the hole while the flywheel's in there and then you use the nut um, on the one end so that you don't have to like mess with this because this is all magnetic so this was all wobbling around a lot really big pain in the ass uh, so that's if I ever had to do this again I would get just the studs and then use a nut put them in inside the flywheel and then put the puller on and then put the nuts on there to hold it um, and then from there I used just, just, uh, this and I used this to get the extra leverage and just kind of saddle, saddled across the ski and just reached down in there and, and it popped off, um, pretty easily. I would say, um, the goal was to replace this thing. The Bendix was frozen. Um, so super easy. Um, to pop it off i was considering paying somebody to do it but they were quoting me about 140 dollars an hour uh which is crazy um and it's like not even that bad so you just take all the the bolts off of the cover and then use that spacer kit or the flywheel puller kit um and it popped right off so i'm gonna reverse everything and hopefully start to ski um clean it up it's been sitting for a while maybe take it out test it and then start using it